Everybody has a different idea of what paradise is. For me, it's exploring the oceans of the world, always on the hunt for the next adventure. Just my drone, my camera, and one single breath. I follow a band of hunters that have returned to their primal roots to capture their next meal. Come with me as I do what very few can do, free dive into depths of over 30 meters with a camera in some of the most remote locations around the globe. I'm Barrett Harvey, and these are my African Spearfishing Diaries. What do you think? You think the wind is blowing? Uh, wind is nothing. We will be fine. <laughs> we will be under the water. Not <laughs> there is no wind under the water. <laughs> Uh, landed. Uh, the airstrip is actually not on the island, it's a, on a little piece of land off the island, so you've got to get on a, a ferry and um, make your way across to Rikatia, which is behind me here, the capital below the mountain there. Uh, the conditions are wild. Uh, we've got 30, 35 knot winds, big swell. This is the lagoon behind me, and as you can see, there's white horses in the lagoon, but we're super stoked to be here. Um, no diving today and probably tomorrow. But we're here for 10 days, so we've got some time, and uh, soon we'll get in the water. We're just going to meet uh, Gerard Grave, uh, G, a Tahitian pirate, make our way to the uh, hotel, and yeah, very stoked to be here and looking forward to some good diving and some, some nice time on this beautiful island. Tonight, a strong wind is arriving here. Tomorrow, day off. No can go. It's really rough. Finally, we are here. <laughs> Inshallah. But uh, yeah, the weather. اليوم طلعنا من جزيرة تاهيتي العاصمة كانت الرحلة ساعتين نزلنا في جزيرة اسمها هاو يعبون الطيارة بترول وبعدها كملنا من هاو إلى هذه الجزيرة ركيتا كانت مدة الرحلة تقريبا أربع ساعات ونص ووقفنا في الجزيرة اللي هي تابعة لهذه الجزيرة اللي هي المطار وخذنا العبارة ولين ما وصلنا لهذه الجزيرة اللي راح نقعد فيها خلال فترة رحلتنا هذه لمدة عشرة أيام. جي. yeah. رانا. good. welcome man. you are wanted soon. let's go look in the garden. we bring a new system here. We bring the the, the, the regular shaft, yeah. okay, and this is from Robelin. When you shoot the fish and the, the spear go through, okay, then when you put, pull it out, so this is will make as a break or as a, a center for, for, for the bar. Okay. Then the, the bar will open. We have... You have two long, what's the, the gun? Is one thirty? this one, okay, this, this for the wahoo. This is my toy, okay. for the big doggies. Of course, traveling always with the sea villa. Okay, the villa. Which you know this is, gun? Which size is one? 130? 135, eh? This is the special uh, villa 135. Okay. The water is uh, 23, 22 degrees. Okay. Good uh, time for the wahoo, eh? 
you come close to the shore, the island for maybe meeting time, maybe yeah, you can see many big big school, many big big wahoo here. Yeah. You have the chance for the dog tooth tuna. Yeah, as well? dog tooth tuna also. Yeah, this time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Good, oh. to be, good to be back here, man. Yeah, in your long time. Yeah, long time, man. Don't see you. Huh? Maybe more than five years, eh, bro? <laughs> yeah. Good. What do you think of the gear they brought? No, it's okay. It's good, huh? Need long, long gun, huh? 130 is okay. And the Vela, the Alemani is okay. It's very good gun, huh? So talk about uh, your diving uh, buddy for us. Yeah. You brought an expert. I have I have an expert guy this time, okay. Uh, he's very professional diving with the scooters, okay. He shot a lot of fish in the Indian Ocean by scooters, chasing uh, doggies by scooter, and he has uh, a world record for the smallest doggies uh, by spear gun, which is good, the smallest <laughs> smallest fish. <laughs> It's a record, it's a record. Hey, Mo. And uh, good level snorkel barra, oh. And uh, the snorkel outside. Yeah. With the record. He shot the fish on the surface. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Professional, huh? Professional. Okay. Okay. Njahaz hag rehla to sayd, inshallah, bukra. Ams wasalna wal yom. الأجواء ما تشجع أن إحنا ننزل بحر فقلنا نرتب أغراضنا أغراض الغاتس الفرود والمسدسات نجهزها حق الصيد إن شاء الله بكرة ونتمنى أن نتوفق بالأجواء ونتوفق بالصيد والأحجام الطيبة في هذه الرحلة معنا صديقنا جيراد هو القائد مالنا في هذه الرحلة ويقول عندهم أحجام ما هو أحجام فوق الخمسين كيلو فبنشوف يقول كاتش بلس 50 كي جي وهو يا yeah. بنشوف إن شاء الله إن شاء الله يا <تصفيق> We've woken up this morning on this beautiful tropical island in the South Pacific. Uh, we've had a day and a half of sitting around waiting for the weather to improve. It's looking uh, better this morning, still a bit of wind, but uh, we're very excited. We're going to get our gear together. Yalla! Yalla! Head over the hill, um, meet the skipper and G, and uh, head out into this uh, beautiful blue water that we've been seeing for one and a half days. We're very, very excited and hoping for good things today. Good, um, <laughs> Good morning, good morning, good morning, good, good morning. morning. We're finally here. We just put our suit and uh, the condition, uh, it looks 50-50. The wind blow and uh, it's cold. So we will uh, go now for in the, uh, drifting in the blue, looking for a big waho, maybe selfish, we'll see. And after that we will go for the Dog is a spot, and uh, we'll see, inshallah. The first day, inshallah, in our trip to the sea, the atmosphere, of course, like you can see, the wind and the moon, but we'll go to the other side of the island, inshallah, to be safe with the wind and we can see what we're going to do, which is the wahu and the animals that we're coming to. So we've prepared our work, and inshallah, we're going to be safe, and we're going to trust Allah.
not good. We have to change the spot because it's murky. I see 30 meters plus visibility, <laughs> and it's it's murky. <laughs> Still a bit windy, quite choppy. We've been in the water for about 15, 20 minutes. Haven't seen anything yet. Put the flashes down. Terror down. Said we need to move because the water is too dirty here. We've got about 30 meters visibility, but apparently it's too dirty, so we have to move. So. Uh, I'd love to know what clean is. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. So we just come from a, a drift in the shallows. Um, it was a little quiet on the Wahoo, so we decided to um, go to the shallows, do a bit of filming, go check out the coral. Quite amazing. There's so much um, reef fish, like uh, coral trout, and there's uh, big boho snappers. But unfortunately, here in um, French Polynesia, a lot of the fish have cicatera. It's like a fish disease that can make us uh, really, really sick. So you can't eat certain fish. Basically, it comes from um, the reef. Uh, small fish eat the, the organisms on the reef, and as it goes up the food chain, um, it, the poison gets uh, more and more concentrated. So when you get to the, the big fish, like the, the coral trout and the uh, boho snappers, the real hunters on the reef, they carry cicatera and can make us really, really ill. So. You gotta be very careful what you eat. Uh, obviously the locals know exactly what you can, you can't eat. Funnily enough, uh, Cicatera was first um, documented on this island here behind me, um, around the 1500s. Guys sailed here, they found paradise. They, they caught a whole lot of fish. They ate it and got really, really sick. The Latin name for Cicatera actually has gambias in it, which is the Gambias archipelago. So yeah, the island behind is where Cicatera was first um, documented. So interesting thing about where we are. Uh, we're in the water for about five minutes. We saw our first wahoo, nice fish, probably 40 to 50 kilos. Fortunately, the guys are still loading their guns and uh, really, really chilled. And by the time they got loaded, it swam off. So, but we've seen our first South Pacific wahoo, nice big one, and yeah, looking good.
Tell me, what do we have for dinner tonight? We have some wahoo. Finally, we found some wahoo. Uh, two nice wahoo. Uh, fortunately, we lost the one. The one's got a nice one. And uh, there was a really nice one, maybe 35, 40 kilos to be around. But after four days of looking, we have found some. So, hopefully, this is just the start. But yeah, happy days. Happy days. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Everybody has a different idea of what paradise is. For me, it's exploring the oceans of the world, always on the hunt for the next adventure. Just my drone, my camera, and one single breath. I follow a band of hunters that have returned to their primal roots to capture their next meal. Come with me as I do what very few can do, free dive into depths of over 30 meters with a camera in some of the most remote locations around the globe. I'm Barrett Harvey, and these are my African spearfishing diaries. <laughs> <laughs>